In the modern automotive landscape, where innovation and convenience intertwine, the humble car key has undergone a remarkable transformation. Once a simple metal tool used to unlock doors and turn ignitions, the key has evolved into a sleek wireless device known as the key fob. Compact, efficient, and indispensable, the fob does far more than unlock a door. It signals identity, grants access, and in many vehicles, even starts the engine remotely. Yet for all its sophistication, it depends on something astonishingly basic, a small coin cell battery tucked discreetly within. And when that battery begins to falter, the car gives you a quiet but unmistakable warning. Key fob battery low. But what does that message truly mean? Is it just a minor inconvenience or the first sign of a digital dependency ready to lapse? Let's take a deeper dive into the world of overlooked innovations right here on History of Simple Things. To understand the gravity of that low battery warning, we must first look at how a key fob functions. At its core, a key fob is a miniature transmitter. It emits radio frequency, RF signals, which are picked up by your car's onboard receiver. These signals are encrypted and unique to your vehicle, providing security while allowing for hands-free interaction. Whether it's unlocking doors with proximity sensors, opening the trunk, or starting the engine with a push button, each function relies on the successful transmission of that signal. The battery inside the fob powers this communication. When the battery weakens, the signal becomes less reliable, like trying to whisper across a windy canyon. The message may still get through, but not always when or how you expect. A low battery warning doesn't mean your key fob will immediately stop working. It's a courtesy from your vehicle a kind of early alert system meant to give you time to replace the power source before total failure occurs. But ignoring it could lead to increasingly erratic behavior. The signal range may shorten, requiring you to stand closer to the vehicle to unlock it. Sometimes, the car may not recognize the key fob at all, even if it's right in your pocket. You might find yourself pressing buttons repeatedly or holding the fob up to the door handle, hoping for a response. These inconsistencies are not merely frustrating, they're a sign that the energy sustaining your car's seamless convenience is running dangerously low. When the fob battery is on its last legs, the real concern isn't just about accessing your vehicle. Many modern cars use proximity-based systems that rely on the fob's presence to authorize ignition. Without a strong enough signal, the car may refuse to start. Imagine standing outside your vehicle on a cold morning only to find it locked and unresponsive. Or worse, sitting in the driver's seat with your foot on the brake, pressing the start button repeatedly while the dashboard flashes a grim message. Key not detected. It's a situation that can quickly shift from a minor hassle to a full-blown disruption, especially if you're far from home or in a hurry. Fortunately, the solution is refreshingly simple. Replacing a key fob battery is often a quick and inexpensive process. Most fobs use CR2032 or CR2025 lithium coin batteries readily available at pharmacies, hardware stores, or online. With a small screwdriver or even a fingernail, the fob casing can be gently pried open, revealing the coin battery within. Matching the old battery's type and polarity, inserting the new one, and snapping the fob back together usually restores full function instantly. Some fobs even retain a small amount of memory, so reprogramming isn't required after a battery swap. It's a small task with a big payoff, restoring your car's digital handshake without a visit to the dealership. Despite its simplicity, many drivers overlook the warning or postpone dealing with it. This is partly because the modern car has trained us to expect a frictionless experience. The idea that something as trivial as a coin battery could compromise that experience feels improbable. But technology's reliability is often built on fragile foundations. As cars become increasingly dependent on wireless systems, keyless entry, app-based controls, remote start, the importance of that tiny battery becomes magnified. 
The key fob is not just a remote, it's a gatekeeper. Its battery is, in a sense, the beating heart of your connection to the machine. It's also worth noting that environmental factors can affect battery life. Extreme cold, for example, can reduce a lithium battery's output, leading to false low battery warnings or shorter functional range during winter months. Conversely, heat and humidity can degrade the battery's internal chemistry over time. Frequent use of the fob, such as repeatedly locking and unlocking the car or using remote start, also accelerates battery drain. On average, a fob battery lasts between two and four years, depending on usage and conditions. Knowing this allows proactive maintenance, changing the battery at regular intervals rather than waiting for the dreaded warning to appear. In some vehicles, if your key fob dies entirely, all is not lost. Most manufacturers design emergency protocols into their systems. Many fobs have a hidden mechanical key for manual door entry. Likewise, some cars feature backup detection zones, places near the start button or inside a compartment, where you can hold the dead fob to initiate a start. These measures offer peace of mind, but they're workarounds, not solutions. The ideal response to a low battery warning is swift and simple. Replace the battery and restore your full range of functionality before you're caught in an inconvenient moment. The message key fob battery low isn't a threat. It's your car's subtle way of saying, I still recognize you, but I'm beginning to fade. In a world increasingly powered by quiet wireless interactions, even something as small as a coin battery carries unexpected importance. What seems like a minor issue is really a reminder that our seamless conveniences often rely on the smallest, most overlooked components. So when that alert pops up, don't ignore it. Take a moment to replace the battery, and in doing so, preserve the invisible handshake between you and your vehicle, one that depends on trust, timing, and just a little power. Electricity itself is not it's a small act, but one that keeps the rhythm of your daily life undisturbed. Because sometimes, maintaining the magic isn't about grand repairs. It's about paying attention to the quiet signals and responding before the silence sets in. That tiny battery may not seem like much, but in the world of modern mobility, it holds the power to unlock far more than just your car. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.